Hey guys, this is Nick from ReviewOutlaw.com. Today I want to show you how to enter a simple trade that's going to auto close at 50%. So I do this same similar trade uh, again and again, multiple times, and I just kind of rinse and repeat, and it seems to generate good income for me. So uh, first thing you want to do is I'm using Tastyworks platform, so hopefully you're using a similar platform, uh, but you want to see what you have for option buying power. So I try to max out my option buying power, use as much credit as I can. So I'm uh, kind of using the money I have to make more money. So I have $577 available to me. Um, generally, I do something called $5 wide spreads. It's most stocks are traded at that. Um, with some some were traded at a smaller to be like a dollar but um, this one uh, that we're looking at is gonna be five dollars so to find the stocks I, I like to invest in stocks that I like uh, so Apple Adobe things like that tech stocks generally I'm comfortable with if you're more comfortable with banking stocks or whatever you like I recommend doing that um, I'm generally bullish on stocks so if you're more of a bearish personality you could also do something similarly um, assuming the stock's going to go down. But when I say bullish, I'm kind of saying that I think the stock's going to either stay the same or go up. So first thing is finding the stock that you want to trade options on. Uh, I click my watch list. I click Tasty Trade Stocks, and I organize by IV rank. Try to have as little information here as possible. If you get too much information, it, 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 it's just too much information. I kind of can't see just the important stuff. So I just organize by IV rank, go down here. I try to go something between the $100 range, $100 and over, because um, it just gives me more credit. So I already have a trade in Netflix, otherwise I'd do that. You want to go by highest to lowest. IBM looks pretty good. I don't have anything in that right now. So also this um, QQQ, which is just a bunch of tech stocks uh, bundled together. But let's look at IBM and we're gonna click trade. Now days are important. I try to go around the 45 day mark when I'm placing trades and I put a 50% close out. So I'm, we're gonna, I'm gonna, this is gonna go to the 58 day mark and um, so now you want, basically now, you know, where do we want to put this in? We have a lot of different options here. The easiest thing is hit short, put vertical, go, and that's going to kind of do most of the work for you. Now I want to look at my probability of profit, my pop, 70%. Um, that's that's kind of where I like to st stay in personally, around 70%. Um, and my pop at 50% is 83 so that's a good number as well my max loss 384 dollars and as you can see here uh, i can afford that in my option buying power so that's basically once i place the trade and it goes through that is going to be with uh drawn from my option buying power um, so we've got date uh, delta is important as well i'm choosing the 32 delta or basically seven seventy percent and that shows right here that I have a 70% chance of this trade being successful. Um, but since I'm closing early, I actually have an 83 chance uh, of being successful. Um, as you can see, the price is changing here. I'm gonna just, so this gets filled, I'm gonna hit this lock and go down like two pennies. Um, even though I'm kinda, potentially could get two more pennies or two more dollars. I'm gonna hit review and send, double check my numbers and send order. And because I lowered it slightly, I went right through. Um, so basically, now I've put my trade in now. If I did nothing, I would have to keep coming back and seeing where my trade was, and, and that, that's kind of inconvenient for me. So what I'm gonna do instead is automatically place a closing order. Easiest way to do that is go to IBM, filled. I highlight that and hit opposite order. So now I just take this amount, cut it in half. So we'll just go dot 55, 55 cents, pretty much a half. And instead of um, day, I'm gonna change this to GTC, which means good to cancel, which basically means this order is gonna constantly work, try to get filled um, at my 50% profit mark. So basically it could be 9 a.m., no, sorry, 9.30 in the morning someday, and it, 
the price is where it needs to be and boom, I close the order, take the money away and I don't have to do any work to keep monitoring to see where this, this stock price is. Um, once that's done, I just hit review and send, double check my things here and hit send order. So that's pretty much how to quickly enter a simple trade um, that's going to auto close. It's going to get generate 50% profit. I've done this repeatedly for many, many months, um, basically over a year and a half actually. And it's been very successful for me just because my positions are constantly working and you can just double check here. If you expand and hit working, you'll see that this right now, the trade is at $1.12 and once it drops down to 55 cents, it's going to close. So I can keep that $55 profit and I can use that money towards the next trade. Um, if you guys have any questions, feel free to let me know. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, thanks for watching my video. If you have time, please subscribe to my channel, click here to watch more videos, or please give me a thumbs up. Thanks.